Hey, y'all, I'm back. I'm still here at the hospital with my sister. Um, she haven't had the baby yet, but he almost on his way. It's apparently, what, four, forty five yeah. Yeah, four, forty five. Yeah, almost on his way. Yeah, it's apparently, what, 445? One on 451, man. When I say I'm so tired because I've been up there. Well, the mommy to be, you uh, The mommy. my beautiful queens and house of kings doing this morning how you all doing welcome or welcome to the start of a new video how you all doing um it's currently 11 51 a.m where i'm at so in a few more minutes it'll be known but how you all doing i'm just wanting to catch well start off a new vlog i'm just going in with that shea butter when i say that african shea butter is really good y'all it is really it don't have no scent, but it's really good. The days I'm the days when I'm currently at the house, I, I don't know, I usually like to try to let my skin breathe from the makeup unless if I'm, you know, recording like a makeup video or something that's different. But this is really good. But yeah, I just normally like to, you know, let my skin breathe a little bit. But I'm just currently sitting here. I was tuning in to a couple of YouTube videos. And I did my um, morning devotion as well as my daily devotion. Faith chat with Rihanna Janice. I was so glad I ended up getting on the call yesterday. Um, I do virtual, virtual. I, I might, once I get this video uploaded, I might, if I can remember to put the information down in the description box for you all. And I'm going to try to remember to put that because I would mind if some of you all, if you can make it on Tuesdays, um, she moved it. It used to be Thursday night, but now she moved it to Tuesday nights at 7 o'clock. I think it just depends on what, you know, what um, city and state you're from. So me, but I currently live in Memphis. I usually get on the call around um, 6 o'clock. Yeah, 6 o'clock or like, 5.50 to, you know, um, and probably sit in like the little waiting room. It's like a Zoom. If you have a Zoom app, I don't know if you all are familiar with Zoom, but most people use that app when they doing like virtual meetings or some jobs use because I know I had to use it back here for my job a couple of weeks ago for a meeting we had. And so I really had the app already installed due to me tending Rihanna Janice's Faith Chat meetings. When I say Faith chat really was, I just felt the spirit. It's like every time when I attend Faith chat, I, I leave like a different person. Like I, I might come in, you know, as one way, but when I leave, I just be so filled, up, just be filled with so much encouragement and, you know, it's inspiration from so many women and men that's a part of that community. And when I say they, they very uplifting and inspiring. And I was thinking about you all. I said, I think once I get this video edited or, upload it i will leave that information down in the description box in case if some of you are you know would like to attend it i will put that down below but yeah it's just it's it's really I, I love to see so many people that's on this same journey like me or people that's trying to get closer with god you know i've probably shared this plenty of times with you all but i'm trying to restore my relationship back with my heavenly father i want to get more closer with him and kind of, you know, let go of a lot of things that's really been getting the best of me. Because, I, like I say, my, my my I have had a rocky past, which I feel like we all, and, you know, probably went through some things in our past. But I just want to do things now in a way that's fulfilling to him and just, for you know, for myself as well. But it's just, I was just sitting here, you know, I ain't going to. I'm sitting up here sampling on some yogurt. 
I haven't had yogurt in a while. I wish I had some strawberries on hand and some granola. I would have made like a little yoga bowl. But like I say, some plain yoga by itself would be good sometimes too. But yeah, I'm just trying to get right with him. You know, um, growing up, you know, I was always, like I say, I think I might have mentioned this to you all. Growing up, I was always in the church. I was, I think, yeah, I was like 13 when I was baptized. But, you know, as you get older and, you know, life's, life's, life be life and for a lot of us. And, you know, sometimes you might fall short on some, you know, things or areas in life. I'm just saying little areas in life where you might not be as strong in. And so that's pretty much what happened with me. Like I say, I, I was in church morning, noon, sometimes night for Bible study. But it's like as I became an adult, I kind of fell short in some areas in my life. Um, and I feel like it made me where I made bad choices, even with, you know, allowing people in my life that should have been gone. But me not having that confidence and that courage to know that I deserve more and better. I felt like I just settled, you know, just settled for anything and anybody that came along in my life. So it's like I'm learning every day to forgive myself more and forgive those who hurt, have hurt, probably hurt of me in the past. But yeah, it's just, it's, 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 I, I don't open up too much about a lot of things that happen because I do, I try to want to keep some things to myself. Like I'm going to share some things that I probably won't, you know, with you all, but in certain areas, like if I decide, you know, if I do decide to get involved in a relationship, if, you know, if this is God's will, then I'm not going to really broadcast my relationship status online. I remember I have had, that never happened with me here on YouTube, but um, when I was doing Facebook, I mean, when I was creating Facebook, um, con I mean, I ain't going to say content because Facebook, you just posting pictures and, you know, sharing quotes and stuff. But it was a lot of things that happened in my past. But like I say, I'm mean, going to create you all the, um, a chit chat with me video and go more deep into it. But yeah, it's just I'm learning every day now. Some things just, you know, it's best to keep to yourself, you know, God blessing you in your winning season with greater opportunities. In some cases, it's just be best to be kept alone until you know that this is the right decision or until you know that, you know, this is going to stay or be, a, you know, stay or if this is going to be like a lifetime situation, I'm going to say it like that. I know sometimes I can stutter across my words when I'm, you know, talking with you all. But yeah, I just kind of wanted to come in and start the video off um, and just say how you all doing. I'm currently making some taco soup. My sister, she been wanting some taco soup. And I just decided, I just told her I'd make, up, make some for her. And um, I wish I had some, what's that, some Doritos on hand. Because I don't know, I really don't want to make cornbread. I got to see if I got some meal and flour. Because I know I do get low, pretty low on certain items. Like, we mostly, I know we mostly go through here in the household a lot of seasoning, eggs, bread. What else? Um, we don't have to eat cereal that much. Breakfast food like bacon, um, like bacon, eggs, bread, uh, what else? Sausage. Like we go through that kind of stuff pretty fast. So um, I might try to place another Instacart by this week. Um, but I know the holiday, Thanksgiving will be Thanksgiving coming right around, approaching soon. But yeah, it just depends because I've been really wanting to give y'all another Dollar Tree haul. Um, that that video still will be in tune. So, um, but yeah, you, I just want to kind of come in and start this while I go. It's been a few hours for light days. Been a few days, but it felt like months. When it comes for you, only like once. Life moves fast when you do what you want. Look like Tyler Berry But she don't love me, she's too scary My hope is fun like Jackie Brown I don't wanna know what she too down Will you be my leading lady? I wanna contract them, no baby In the meantime, it's not going well, huh? It's the 
to the start of the um, new blog. I'm just sitting here in the hospital. I had just, I remember working on the phone. Yeah, I got off of work uh, like two hours ago. I'm here with my sister. She's about to get ready and give birth. Yeah. Well, the mommy to be, you all. The mommy to be. <laughs> the mommy to be. Hey y'all, I'm back. I'm still here at the hospital with my sister. Um, she haven't had the baby yet, but he almost on his way. It's apparently what 4:45, going on 4:51. Man, when I say I'm so tired because I've been up since 4 this morning, 4 a.m. I had get a, got a call from my mom panicking when I was at work. He told me it was urgent, so I had rushed down here. You know, checked and see, and I'm still here at the hospital. I said, I think after when she delivered the baby, I'm gonna go home and take me a shower because I'm a little tired and I haven't eaten anything. Can y'all believe that? Normally, I would eat, normally, I had the biggest appetite. I haven't eaten anything all day yet and still not hungry, but yeah, I'm still here. Yeah, it's really cold. I got my, got my jacket on. I'm just free. Good morning, how my beautiful queens and house of kings doing this morning? How you all doing? Welcome. Oh, welcome back to uh, to another day in this vlog. I think I'm going to end this vlog. I'll actually, when I get to talking to you all this morning, but well, welcome back. Um, so yesterday, the last time I talked to you all, I was at the hospital. I did work yesterday. That was my first day back at work. But currently, I'm all... Currently, business is just super slow. Um, you might well say I got like a little mini week this upcoming week. Happy Friday to you all as well. You might well just say this is just going to be a, a – I, I, I don't go back to work until next Wednesday. So I only work two days. It's what – yeah, two days the following week. And I think I'm going to go deep into a video because I have posted on my community page yesterday – um, or I think I did it this morning. It might have been yesterday. And I was telling you all that I will give you all like a little life update chit chat video about my feelings, how I've been feeling lately. Um, and I'm just going to, you know, just share from, you know, just open up, just share from my heart and just, you know, just express how I've been feeling these last, really these last few days and probably within this year because like i said this year haven't really been the best for me it's just been very rocky and i'm gonna just go deep into you know my feelings in that video but um currently um i when i got to talk to y'all yesterday i was at the hospital in the room with my sister y'all know i told y'all if you've been following me y'all seen me vlog uh, my sister baby shower i went live stream and i went uh, i did like a look regular vlog so y'all had got like two parts of the baby shower she actually went into um labor yesterday so i got a call from my mother when i was at work and i rushed when i left work i just had to go straight to the hospital and 
I sit out there, because y'all know my schedule. I get up at 4 a.m. in the morning. So I, I, I was up from 4 a.m. in the morning all the way until probably like 9 o'clock p.m. yesterday at night. Because, like I said, I had to work yesterday morning. Then I had to rush from work and go, you know, sit with my sit with my sister in the hospital. I thought she was going to give birth yesterday. But apparently, um, her, she wasn't in, what's that? Because it's been so long, like I say, I, I had to go through the same thing. But, like I say, I, I think, from my understanding, you have to be, like, nine centimeters um, dilated in order for them to, you know, for you to be able to push the baby out. So, um, she wasn't quite there yet. So, um, I think I'm gonna go out there with her today and, um, sit out there with her for a little while. You know, cause she haven't, I thought she was gonna give birth right then and there yesterday, but she did cause I was trying to stay the whole day, but I'm gonna go out there and sit with her today. But yeah, I, um, yeah, so, yeah, he should be here today, though, my um, little nephew. I ended up getting him a little uh, bassinet where she can have so she can, uh, you know, he can have something to sleep in because that's how it was when I had my daughter. You know, she slept in a little bassinet up until, like, three months, I want to say, to basically to up until she started sitting up. So I feel like when they start getting a little older babies and sitting up and all that moving around in the bassinet, you know it's time to upgrade them to like a little, you know, a bigger size baby bed. But from, you know, from birth, like a newborn, bassinets are good to have. And I have found the one off of Amazon because that's what I actually have by my brother's baby, uh, uh, bassinet off of Amazon too when he was a little baby. Um, I thought they might have had it in blue, but I... The bassinet is a beautiful bassinet. It's like a little cream, all white color. But yeah, I ended up getting that for her so she could, he could have a bed to sleep in. But yeah, overall, um, my day was great. It just it's been so much stress on me like these last couple of days. That's why I said it, it almost made me rich. But like I said, I'm gonna just start. I, I think I might just do the life. It, it just depends on where I'm at because when I'm opening up and chatting with you out about certain things, I, I just I kind of be want to be alone sometimes. So, But I mean, I'm going to give you a life update. there have been so many times where I've been wanting to update, talk to you all like in the park, but now it's really cold. I was going to drink. I'm actually drinking coffee out of here too, my iced coffee. Um, I had got well, my former co-worker who I be, uh, used to work with me at the old job. He used to work. Yeah, I know we used to have a full service Starbucks there. And they was giving away these little free little red um, Starbucks cups. And I, you know, he gave me this and told me to keep it. And I just been, you know, drinking out of it ever since. I do need to give me another one like this, but like a solid color where I can have, you know, to drink around on the day to base. Because this one, this one cute. But it's giving more like Christmas vibes, holiday vibes, where I can, you know, pull this out for the holidays. But I do need to give me another one. I know the dollar stores, they used to carry these kind of little cups, too. Because I, I think when I bought one in the past, it was like a um, like a tan looking cup. And it say rise and shine and had the little sun. It was so pretty. I had got it from like the Dollar General. But I haven't been to the Dollar General in the wild now down by my job. It just goes to show you how life meant life for me and then i've been trying to you know just really budget on the street budget but yeah but overall uh it's it's my morning started out great i did my morning oh yeah i'm sorry i did my morning devotion yeah no, my daily devotion. Well, the daily devotion, which is the little women's book, I be reading. I read the two pages out of that today. Very, just you know, y'all seen it before I tune in. I just got to read that. I think when I get through chatting with you, I, I'm gonna try to research a scripture and uh, find a scripture on how I've been feeling and seeking. I find a. Uh, you know, a verse in the Bible to read, just to, you know, to you know, um, lift me up in that, you know, in that spirit, in the moment. I'm saying like that, but um, yeah. But other than that, it, it's just it's a lot. It's just like I say, life, life, man, really life, and life. You know, you just never know what might come your way. And like I say, I'm always the person that you know try to stay strong a lot. And in some cases, um. You know, I'm falling apart. Like, you know, it's it's hard sometimes being a woman. I know, you know, I know 
men say it'd be hard being a man, but I feel like, you know, even as a woman, we just we go through just as much as like a male too, because we're they we're supposed to be like considered the nurturers. We have to make sure we're taking care of um the children, the kids, the, you know, if you marry, I'm not married, never been married. I am praying for a husband someday. That's my you know, if in God's willing. But we got to make sure we cook, clean, do the laundry, you know, to make sure we're taking care of the household, you know, and it, it just, it's a lot. And what people don't realize is like when you opening up about how you really feeling, it just, sometimes people don't just really, you know, understand your, you know, that your feelings are just as valid as anybody else's. And it's like, lady, I've just been finding myself just really getting more disconnected being disconnected from you know people and just people that I just feel like just not in my you know that don't mean me well I'm gonna say it like that but like I say when I get through um I'm gonna go on to edit this video and and I'm gonna just kind of just do some major thinking about what all are because like I say I'm gonna just this just gonna be like a random chit chat video I'm just open up about you know how I've been feeling because like I say, y'all know, I tell y'all, I feel like with my China, I'm trying to, I, I know 40, maybe 40 to 50% of women follow me. And I just want to be a voice, not just for myself, but for everybody that might be tuning in. And like I say, when I do, you know, come on camera, I do like to tr do show my authentic self. But I do like to, you know, express how I'm feeling in the current moment, maybe to help uplift someone because I'm the type I do worry about and I'm concerned about others as well. You know, I know everybody, you know, might not have nobody they can communicate with or talk to. And so I just be wanting to be that voice sometimes just for, you know, p people in general to let us know that, you know, regardless of what we might face in life, that you know, God going to still be in control. And that's another thing, too. That's why I said, even with my faith, like I still read my word a lot in my Bible. I, I read it every day, you know, but it's like I'm starting to lack in that area because it's like every the things that I've been wanting to come true. I'm not seeing it at the moment. But um, overall, like I say, I'm just trusting God, you know, with the, with the with the rest of the rainy year and, and doing my journey, whatever He got planned for me. But with, with that being said, I think I'm gonna go on the um, end the vlog off right here, so I can go on to edit it and have this ready for. Um, I might upload this. What's today? Tuesday. I might try to have this video upload. I mean, today Friday. I might try to save this video for. I might upload it Monday. That'll be a start of a new week. I'll probably just say this video for Monday. But yeah, until then, you all, you all have a great rest of the um, week. You enjoy your weekend, and you all continue to stay safe out here. Bye-bye. I love you all.